Hello everyone. The reason Chief and I are gathered is we just wanted to have a conversation and provide a bit of an update. We've been talking since May. Obviously uh, in the Winsville School District we had a number of very troubling events that occurred during the month of May and we've had very honest, very candid dialogue as we've had since we've had the opportunity to work together and just wanted to provide our community, our parents, our students, uh, all of our stakeholders, just an update of things, uh, how we think, what our thoughts are, and what we're thinking about as we move forward. Yeah, parents, it's extremely important that you monitor your, uh, your child's social media activity. Uh, threats, rumors of threats, those have uh, lasting and uh, reaching uh, consequences, so please monitor the uh, social media activity of your uh, student. And if your students see something or hear something on social media, certainly they need to let a, you know or a teacher know, and let any adult know that uh, what they've seen. We just have a long-standing tradition in district. If you see or hear something, please say something. Not just to friends or colleagues, but make sure that you're saying something to a trusted adult, administrator, another staff member, teacher, anyone in the schools, a parent. Make sure you're sharing that feedback if you see or are hearing anything. Another real important point is that if a child, student uh, shares or sees something or shares it and spreads the rumor, that's, they're going to be held uh, responsible for that and there's going to be consequences to that. And we do work with the uh, juvenile court system and the adult court system and uh, there are appropriate charges that we will charge uh, individuals with for sharing or spreading rumors. I'm all in favor of a good joke, but there are things that are not funny. And we're talking about the safety of individual students, we're talking about the safety of groups of students, building buildings, the district as a whole, there's some things that simply aren't funny. We just have to understand there is a line that we're going to take that's going to be serious when it comes to those threats in terms of things that you consider jokes that are actually really threatening in nature. Yeah, one of the things I'll ask the parents to do is uh, as you hear rumors going around, if you're getting text messages from your child in school that there may be something going on, please rely on the school district information that they put out or the police department's information uh, because we don't need the rumors to spread anymore. We do take school safety very seriously. There are going to be situations where there will be consequences. I need the public to understand one important piece. There are consequences for an individual student. There are pieces that we simply cannot disclose as a school district. We can't disclose the information. That doesn't mean that we aren't taking the behavior very seriously when it comes to consequences and assigning consequences. And one last piece is just this. We not only have an amazing relationship with the Winsville Police Department, but all of the municipalities in the Winsville School District. There's a lot of work that we engage in on a very frequent basis, oftentimes behind the scenes. All of this to ensure that everyone is safe here in the Winsville School District. Yeah, and I want to thank everybody for working with us to help keep our community safe our, and our students safe in all of our schools. Chief, I appreciate what you do, Thanks, what Sergeant all of your, your uh, department does as well. We really appreciate it. Thank you, appreciate you. And everyone, we're going to have a fantastic start to the school year. Absolutely. Have a good day. Thank you.